Hi, grade twos. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to draw a number line and you can use this number line as a strategy to help you add and subtract numbers. So what you're going to need is, is a piece of paper and a ruler and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to draw a straight line and at the end of my lines I'm going to have arrows to show that numbers keep going even beyond zero into the minus numbers and above 20 into 21 and 22 and so on. All right, so I'm going to start by plotting the numbers on my number line. So I'm going to start with zero there and I want to try my best to leave um, the same amount of spaces between my numbers. So if you find using your finger to leave a finger space works or even if you want to use the numbers on your ruler that can even work too. So I'm going to use the numbers on the ruler to give me 20 perfect lines and there I'm using the centimeter side. 12, 13, 19, 20, oh, I got up to 21, there we go. Okay, so here I'm going to write 1, 2, and I have perfectly spaced numbers. Making a number line is actually really, really easy. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. I even got 21. Oh. Let's make that look a little more clear. All right, so I'm also going to do a, just a quick demonstration on how I would use my number line to add and take away. So let's say I have 7 and I want to add four more. And I'm going to use my number line to do that. I'm going to start at seven and I'm going to count, make four hops. Each hop is one number from seven to eight. That's one, two, three, four. It's kind of like a game and I land on 11. So I know seven plus four equals 11. Now let's do a takeaway. Remember when I take away, I'm moving the opposite direction on my number line. So let's say I have the question 13, take away, I want to take 5 away. I'm just going to erase my hops so I don't get confused. I'm going to start at 13 and instead of my numbers getting more, they're going to get less because we're taking away. So I'm going to start at 13 and I'm going to do 5 hops. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and I end up on 8. So this is how you can use a number line to help you do adding and take away. Good luck!